using this video. I don't know if I'm actually going to do anything with it yet. If I do, you'll know because you're watching it. But I'm using this as a bit of an excuse to show up the electric skateboard and uh, my new GoPro and toys and stuff. Got the Trillist of Trill bird food and some water for myself. Now we can uh, lure in our uh, subjects. Turn on. Good girl. So I can hear a lot of birds about. This is a good thing. There's something definitely above me. Some bird feed in there. That's a lot. So I found out that pigeons actually eat 10% of their body mass. So most pigeons weigh to about whoa pigeon feather. They're definitely close. Anyways, they weigh about 300, 350 grams. So they eat about 30 grams a day. So that shouldn't kill one. So we're good there. And I bought some more here just to. I don't really know what I'm doing. I'm just going for it. I'm just gonna have to hope for the best and I might have to do this a few times. Like I said, I don't know if I'm gonna use this. But hopefully this will, this will help me on my bigger project that I'm working on for you guys and myself. Now all I gotta do is wait, I guess. So I keep you edited. So I think I'll come out a bit late. I should imagine the best time would be 12, but I mean, it's a good start. I mean, I'm learning from this. Not gonna be a lot of content about, unfortunately. Stay. Stay. Good girl. Go on. Uh, yeah, no, it's day two. I've come out earlier in the day since yesterday was a bad idea. Oh. Yeah, I'm just going to go back up to the same spot. And uh, hopefully it's a lot better this time around. So uh, here we go. So there are a lot of pigeon feathers. That's what I would describe playing around. A lot of baby looking ones. So I'm starting to think that I'm trying to catch pigeons a bit too late. So. Almost straight away this time around. We have Robin knocking about, checking it out. Okay. No, don't fly away. Turn my hat backwards because things are getting serious right now. There we go. We can see the white bar under its wing. Wings all short of the tails. And it's got a white patch on its neck. It's definitely a wood pigeon. What I came out here to find. Shame you just won't stop showing me this behind. So here is another wood pigeon. You can tell it's a wood pigeon because there's a little bit of white on its neck. I don't know if you can see there. It's got that little white patch. And we've got another family in the trees to our right. Visibly able to see the white bit on its neck and the wing bar.
very nice breast. The white patch on its neck and a white bit under its wing again. Little, little pigeon. You can understand me telepathically, can't you? We are connected by the force. And they want to be careful. Got a red kite in the sky as well. He's just scouting out, he knows these guys are about. Roxy's just enjoying herself. I think you're having a good time, huh? Okay, so I've uh, decided that it's time to leave. I've got some decent footage of uh, wood pigeons today. A lot better than yesterday. Um, simply because I've gone out in a more active time of day, which was stupid of me to go out like just before dusk yesterday. Uh, me and the dog ha have had a really good time, but it's time to take her back and go into town before work and try to get some uh, urban pigeon footage. Is that a pigeon? I'll get paid. No, look the head. Yeah, it is. 